Hey guys, it's me, Mecca Marie, and I'm back with another video. If you guys want to see how I did this hair, stay tuned. I got this hair from Amazon Prime. Yes, I did, honey. And I'm going to be showing you how I bleached the knots and installed this hair. I'm also going to be giving you guys a review on this hair. And I want you guys to do a get ready with me. I want you guys to stay tuned and see my makeup look. And we're going to go get into the video. Okay, guys. This is pretty much how the hair looks straight out the box. I just wanted to show you guys exactly how good this hair looks already. Straight out the box. In the next clip, you are going to see me bleach the knots. I'm going to tint the lace. And I'm going to pluck this hair. This quality, it is very soft. Like, dumb soft. It's really soft. It feels real good. Wait. Pull that back. Okay. <laughs> but the hair is very lightweight. Um, it's not shedding at all. It's actually running through my fingers, like running through it. So, so I'm gonna do my little magic, and I will be back. So let's get into the next clip. So right here, I'm just gonna be showing you guys how I bleach the knots. In this clip, I'm just gonna be mixing the BW2 powder and the 40 developer to get the right consistency that I need. So right here, this is the consistency you want. You want it like almost like a marshmallow. You don't want no movement. You see that? You don't want it to seep into the lace because it'll bleach your knots a little too quick and it'll start to bleach your hair. So I'm gonna be showing you how we do this. You wanna make sure that you're pressing firmly. You don't wanna press too hard, but you wanna press firm enough that it starts to work, okay? So now I am using aluminum foil to make the process go a little faster. Okay guys, so since I already bleached the knots and I tinted the lace already, I did go ahead and flat iron it just a little bit. Look at that. It's so soft and it feels so good after just washing it and conditioning it. I actually didn't get that on camera, me washing the hair because I did not want to over bleach my hair. So I will be plucking this hair. Um, I'm not going to pluck all of the hair on camera because it just helps for me to pluck it a little bit off camera. Um, but if you see me looking this way, this is because my mirror is this way and I have no other way to look. Clearly. Now for the middle, I kind of don't have like a specific way of plucking. I just pluck from this side and then I'll start on this side. So. You do not want to over pluck your wig, so please take your time. Do not rush. So you always want to cut your lace into three parts. So you're going to cut once on the left side of the lace and the other on the right side of the lace. So it's easier for you to cut the hair in sections. Now I'm just going to be cutting off the extra hair that goes over my ear and I'm going to be cutting it off on both sides. Okay guys, now that my ears are cut, which I didn't do on camera because I didn't want to mess it up. See that? Cut my ears. It feels so much better, but now I'm going to actually start to glue the hair down. 
So now that I have glued the hair, I will be taking some foaming spray and lay the hair all the way back. How cute is this hair? Um, just so that I can have an easier cut. You want to make sure there is no baby hairs in your way so you do not cut off your hair. You just are cutting the lace. You want to make sure that you're cutting in a zigzag motion. So you'll see you me kind of cutting and it's not you straight. You just see me you cutting see basically kind of in that. a zigzag motion. That is because you want your lace to melt. You do not want it to go straight across because you can clearly see it and it's not cute. It will not be cute like that. So keep going in if you have to, but make sure that you're cutting it as best as you can. Let's get into how beautiful this hair is, you guys. Hair so bomb, make you wanna say. Ew! You can actually see just how well I got this hair to melt to my skin. I mean, it's looking so good. It's looking so sexy. Hi guys, I'm back and my hair is pretty much done. Super cute. So now I want you guys to get ready with me. I'm gonna do my makeup really quickly, really briefly for you guys. All right, let's get into this makeup video. If you see me looking this way, it's because my mirror is this way. But let's get it. I'm about to do my makeup. This foundation that I'm using is actually by Fenty and what I love about Fenty is that um, their foundation matches the concealers. So this Fenty concealer is also in the shade 350 and my foundation is 350. With my sponges before I apply them to my face, it just gives it a smoother look. I really love Fenty makeup because it's made for skin of color. It's made for skin of all kinds and all shades. This is the Masquerade Mini by Juvia's. I love this palette. These colors are beautiful. 
So let's see which ones I'm going to be using for today. So what I am using for my inner eyes was this and this and then what I used for my outer eyes were this and this. This color and this color. Okay, so now that I'm done with my outer eyes, I put a little bit of this in the in my in the middle of my eye. Now I am going to be using Fenty, but this is a Fenty Diamond Bomb. This is called Fenty Diamond Bomb, and it says Cognac Candy. And basically, this is a highlighter. It's bronze. So this hair is by Sunder Hair. If you want to know any more information about this hair, I will be leaving a link down below in the description box. So this hair is the Brazilian Body Wave Human Hair Lace Front Wig. It's 130% density, guys. This right here is an 18 inch. Now this wig costs only $132. The cap size is a medium. Uh, my head normally is a small, but it did um, fit because they do have wig clips. This wig did have a free part of space. I do like mine's in the middle, so I did do one in the middle, but you can part this hair anywhere. So thank you guys for watching all the way through. Thank you guys for commenting and just giving your commentary on my page. I completely am thankful. Again, it's me, Mecca Marie. I'm going to shortly cut in so you guys can see my nails Ooh. I hope you guys love the video I hope you guys like my nails please like comment and subscribe I want to say to you guys thanks for watching bye